Wealth Out of Waste or WOW is an Ahmedabad based company that believes in solving the problem of waste first at the consumer level. I'm running my venture Wealth Out of Waste in Ahmedabad, incubated by Venture Studio Ahmedabad, Ahmedabad University. Uh, we, are, we are running a waste management company, uh, the door to door dry recyclable waste collection. We collect paper, plastic, metal, glass, wooden, as well as e-waste directly from the source. The present recovery and utilization of paper waste by paper mills in India is 3 million tons annually, which translates to a recovery of 20% of the total paper and paper boats consumed. And Wealth Out of Waste is looking to heighten this number with its unique approach. WOW processes their waste in two steps. The primary segregation of the waste is done at the location of the customer and the secondary segregation at the warehouse, from where the material is sent to the recyclers in the city. So what we have done uh, under the WOW, Wealth Out of Waste, we have cut off the chain. We are directly sourcing from the customer who generates the waste by paying him the optimized value. And that waste, through our logistics and our manpower, and through sorting systems, we deliver directly to the end user, which uses as a raw material for further processing. Along with giving a fair price to the customers and employment to waste workers, WOW is also striding ahead with its digital amenities. With the introduction of technology, the ERP system, the mobile application, where you have a database of each and every customer, we would be, uh, we would be sitting on a mine of database in future, right? Uh, where we can trace uh, how much quantum of material, how much paper, how much plastics, how much metal is generated by each household uh, in their houses. If you generate a waste, you, you, the bin or the collection center should be nearest by. So that will motivate the customer not to throw other way. After having worked in the waste sector for over seven years, Vow's founder Vijay has identified the hurdles in the industry. 